Hello, my fifth graders. Um, we're going to jump off of what we learned in the beginning of this week, continuous contour line drawings, but this time we're going to draw them digitally. So the task of today's assignment, using Google Canvas, please develop a continuous contour line digital drawing. You're going to watch this demonstration, which you already are, um, you're going to use various tools on the left side of Google Canvas to develop your drawing. If you're stuck on what to draw, use this link. It will help you um, generate an art prompt. Um, you can draw whatever you want. You'll see I'm going to show you in a second what I'm going to draw, but you can develop any type of drawing that you want. Um, and then four, when you're done, you're going to download it to your computer and then upload it straight to Google Classroom. All right, so if you click on this link right here, it brings you to Google Canvas, and it it will bring you to this, um, this opening. You're going to start a new drawing by clicking that, and it brings you to a new drawing. Over here on the left are all of your tools. These, this one is the color palette, so you, you have generated colors for you, or you can click on one and then customize it. Say you want that little darker, which is okay. You can have that. Below that is the size and opacity. Okay, so size means how thick or thin your tool is going to be. All right. Opacity talks about solid or see-through. So on the left, if it's on the left, it's more see-through. If it's more towards the right, it gets more solid, okay? Right here is your pencil tool. Right here is your pen tool. Right here is your marker tool. This is your chalk tool. And this is your eraser. They all do different things, all right? So that's the pencil. This is the pen. This is the marker. And again, um, you can mess around with the size and all that. This is the chalk. And this is the eraser, all right? Um, I'm going to just undo everything that I just showed you so that I can start my contour line drawing. I'm gonna work with the pen. That's my favorite um, tool to use. I'm going to um, make it a little bit thinner, but also make it more solid so the opacity is over to the right. And I want to draw a flower, all right? but I want to make sure that it's a contour line, a continuous contour line flower. What I'm going to do is just click down on my mouse and make sure I don't unclick while I draw my flower. All right, now that my continuous contour line flower is drawn, I can go in and change the colors if I want. Um, maybe I want a more pink petal, or um, maybe I want a red petal, um, but you can go in and you can color them as um, what you would like. So um, maybe you use the marker tool to go in and color that in. And then you're, so you're gonna develop your drawing and color it and then um, when you're done let's say I'm done with my flower and and it's ready to submit I've colored every single thing I'm ready to submit it it's going to get a 100 I'm gonna come over here to these three dots I'm going to save image as it will download as canvas and then I'm going to go to Google Classroom and upload my image straight from my computer just like you have done in the past with your visual journals, okay?